Hey guys, Silence Hero here. Welcome back to another Utamekra's Gacha video. If you're wondering why this video takes so long to come out, well, it's mainly because I've been stuck at home quarantine because of the flu. Uh, I've been sick for the last five days and ongoing and the flu is just not wanting to go away. So yeah, guys, stay healthy, keep hygienic, wash your hands, do all the necessary stuff to stay away from any kind of viruses, not just the main one that's troubling the whole world. You know, we just have to be careful because it's not just the flu virus or the the virus that is really hitting the world hard right now. Um, we just have to stay away from all the unnecessary bad things in the world. So guys, stay positive and of course, stay healthy. Alright, so I am well enough to make a video. So let's finally dive into this gacha. Um, before it disappears in another two days time or so so let's take a look at the gacha page and let's talk about the two gachas that are available um, uh oh ah there it is so I for a moment there I thought Reina's gacha ended so let's talk about Reina's gacha first because it's kind of like a reissue gacha at the same time, it features a brand new plate, which is what you're looking at right now. So a very electrifying um, illustration for Reina. And yeah, let's take a look at Reina's brand new plate and compare it with her old one, which is what you're seeing on the screen now. So let's take a look at the brand new plate first. Alright, so 3,866 total score. Well balanced stats all around. So the total score is definitely high. Definitely looking to be somewhere in the top tiering episode plates. Well, let's just compare the skills and maybe the special note attached to the episode plate to see which is actually better Reina's brand new plate or the older one. So, yeah, so exclusive to the blue series songs only, her center skill will only activate when it's, you know, used for that version of songs. So, units total is boosted by 35% up, not the best percentage out there, <laughs> excuse me, you can tell, my nose is still stuck with lots of mucus, yes, disgusting, but, you know, it's your body natural function, so, <laughs> alright, so moving on to the next page, center skill, alright, no, active skill, see, my mind is not thinking well, <laughs> <laughs> That's how badly I am sick right now. Um, active skill, li life recovery of 50% up. A pretty good amount. It's the highest you can get for recovery at this point in time. So which is good because you need that life recovery when you want to tackle that 125% bonus mission. Um, where you need to clear the life with 80% health or more. So that active skill actually is pretty important at this point of time um, but yeah let's take a look at the last skill which is the most important for this uh, episode plate so the life skill combo and bonus if you guys still don't know what it does shame on you go ahead and watch all my previous gacha videos and catch up on your utai macros <laughs> all right so with that said combo bonus does have no wait was it the other thing that was boosted not combo bonus uh, I can't really remember right now but I'm too sick to go and bother with it. <laughs> so let's stick to the last page um, to see whether it comes in the special notes if you guys really want to bug me about what I am missing out in this info <laughs> like the new boost for you know life skill uh, you can tell me in the comments below I, I will read it when I am somewhat um, sane enough to do so <laughs> all right let's take to the last page huh so the new plate doesn't come with any special notes attached to it so let's compare it with the old plate looking at it you know the life skill is pretty okay and considering that the center skill is a series exclusive skill with 
a decent percentage boost. I wouldn't call this one of the best episode plates out there, but it's still pretty good because of its high total score. So let's take a look at the old plate of Reynas. There we go. 3799 in total score. It's it's just like a few hundred I don't know actually it's just about a hundred total points away from the new episode plate. So even though it doesn't have like well balanced stats all around, it focuses more on charm and soul. But the total score ain't that far off. So I guess it seems like the old plate might actually be better. So, center skill A rank, let's not bother with it and let's move on. Active skill, well for 20 seconds you will have an easier time touching notes, which is also a pretty good center skill or an active skill uh, compared to the life recovery on, really depends on what you need it for. Life skill, so that's the main thing we are going to compare. This one is a score and repeat, so in the long run, this episode plate might be actually better for those who are, you know, having difficulty stacking up combos because, you know, you tend to break miss because the song's difficulty might be a bit too challenging for you. So score repeat skills are usually the best way for people who are not that versatile with music games, I guess. Uh, your thumbs are probably stiff needs more practice, that kind of thing. I, I myself personally prefer score repeat skills uh, rather than the meta, you know, um, combo combo retaining life skills. You see, my mind can't really think up of all the skills they made at this point of time. That's how sick I am. <laughs> I apologize. <laughs> Anyways, last page. Yes, we all know this episode play of Reynas comes with score note attached to it. So, without a doubt, Reynas Oldham plate is actually better than the brand new one. So guys, if you are Reyna fans, I think aiming for the old plate is what you really want to do compared to the new one. I mean, if you're a Reyna fan, yes, you definitely want to get the new plate just for the illustration because you can use it for your phone's wallpaper or your desktop's wallpaper after you've obtained the episode plate itself. You know, but aside from that, Reyna's older plate is actually looking better than the new plate itself. I mean, compared to illustration-wise, the new one definitely looks a lot nicer. But in terms of usefulness, the old one takes the cake. So, am I going to pull this Gacha for Reyna? Um, sadly to say, no. Because I've already unlocked Reyna's costume and I don't see a need to do so anymore. Uh, unless, you know, I'm really die hard for that brand new episode play. But seriously, to be honest, I am really not. <laughs> I mean, I am a Reyna fan, but, you know, it's not that essential. Alright, so let's move on to the kind of brand new <laughs> episode plate for Freya. I mean, it's out for a few days now. Not exactly very new. But okay, I mean, it is featuring Freya in her fashionable Macross costume. Um, I can't remember exactly when that fashionable Macross happened. Probably, I think, three events. No, almost four events ago uh, for fashionable Macross. Uh, so yeah, um, so let's take a look at Freya's brand new plate and see how it fares compared to Reyna's brand new plate. So 3867 total score, somewhat slightly lower than Reyna's in terms of total. But it definitely has more boost on soul compared to the rest, even though it's somewhat well balanced out. Center skill, total A plus life A. Hmm. So it's a combination center skill. Units total and life is boosted by 20% up. Now, 20% up is pretty low. Uh, even though it's an S rank and a combination skill. From this, you can probably tell that Freya's plate is not meant to be a center position episode plate, but rather a life skill support. So let's move on to the second page to double confirm. 
Yep, there we go. So, life recovery of 50% up. I mean, 50% recovery. <laughs> um, you know, it still can be used as a center position plate, just like Reyna's brand new plate, which this event really needs. So, if you're not pulling Reyna's gacha, Freya's episode plate can stand in uh, to do the same thing as what Reyna's plate can do. And it does come with combo bonus as well. So it's almost identical, just that it's lacking in the total score compared to um, Reyna's. But, well, to each their own. If you're a Reyna fan, if you're a Freya fan, you know which gacha to pull. You know, of course, the last page. It doesn't come with any special notes attached to it, just like Reyna's brand new plate. But for me personally, I'm all about the costumes. So yes, I am definitely pulling Freya's brand new uh, gacha just for this costume. And of course, hopefully to get some episode plates with costume points. The luck has been drained. You guys have seen my video. If you have not, please go and watch it. That amazing pool is astonishing i myself cannot believe it happened and i have no idea how many more months later will i ever see it happen again so let's do this guys a 10 uh plate episode discounted pool i don't know if i want to do more because we're just like a few days away from the next event gacha happening i definitely want to keep aside some singing stones for that oh we get some decent loads. There we go. Nice. Nice Valkyrie animation. But it might not mean anything. Oh my goodness. Oh! We do get a rainbow box on the second blink. So, the, the first blink was kind of scary. <laughs> With no, no red boxes at all. But, you know, that rainbow box might be an old episode plate. So... There we go. Yeah, there we go. It's an old plate, but a pretty good old plate actually. Because <laughs> this one comes with that special item note attached to it. So definitely a good pull, even though it's an old plate. Oh, there we go. That's one thing I want to see. All right, we still have the red box. So no evolution to it. Ooh. Okay, I'm very satisfied. It's a very pretty illustration for a red, uh, uh, red plate, I guess. A red box plate. <laughs> uh, okay, so not many plates. You know, it's just one single plate with Freya's costume points. Uh, good enough, I guess, considering that I can unlock it in the future with episode orbs. But I'm kind of low in that department right now. I'm still um, yet to unlock Kaname's um, Captain costume because that's the one that has the color of uh, variation right now uh, that was recently introduced in the Kiawa ranks for upgrading. So yeah, I'm kind of backlogged on unlocking costumes because of costume points. So I guess Unlocking Freya's brand new costume will be put off to a lot of days later or months, maybe even half a year. Who knows? I don't know when I will get enough stocks of episode arcs to unlock it. <laughs> so until then guys, thank you guys so much for watching this very um, rough put together <laughs> gacha video. I'm still sick. And I'm definitely going to go pop some pills and head to the bed again uh, right after this once I've uploaded it. <laughs> Do that guys. Thank you guys so much for watching all the way to the end if you do. If you did, you guys are awesome. Leave a like to this video if you enjoyed my nonsensical rambling while being sick. <laughs> Comment down below your thoughts on this episode plates and the two gachas. Even your own pools as always and subscribe for more nonsensical sick videos like this I mean this this video is definitely not sick in a cool way, but I am very sick Until then guys. Bye